Gentlemen, congratulations. Uh, Wan, first of all, uh, how does it feel to be through and to be seeded? It feels good. <laughs> um, I think the second half was very good. First half, I have to say, they played very good. They made it difficult for us. We didn't get the rhythm, we didn't play good with the ball, uh, and they were good. Second half, we started much better. We changed a little bit the shape, which I think was good for us, and we scored nice goals. We are through, top of the group, so a happy night. Two goals for Mason Greenwood. He's some prospect, isn't he? He's got goal with himself. Any, every time he plays, he scores. In training, when we do games, he might not touch the ball a lot, but when he's in the box, he's, he's a proper finisher. He's a killer in the box, and we are very happy for him. He's developing very well, nice kid. Two goals in Europe, so very happy. Your first goal for a while? Yes, it feels nice to score again. Uh, hopefully, I start now a good run of goals and uh, I can help my team with, with goals and assists like today. Any anxiety stepping up to take it? You've had a few penalty takers this season, missed one or two? No, no, I was, I was confident. Uh, so I'm, I'm happy about the penalty, but I'm happy also about the performance of the second half for, from all the team. It's not only the ones that scored, the, the whole team played very good. It's difficult when you're not playing a lot of games to get in the team and have the rhythm, but I think in the second half we showed that everyone can play. Not many people saw that coming, did they? I mean, four goals in ten minutes or so. What did the manager say at half-time to get you going? Now that we have to press like a team, we have to press them more as a, and be more compact, don't let them play so much because they're good on the ball and, and it worked out well. Not just Mason Greenwood, but do you think a few of the youngsters stepped forward and proved themselves tonight? Yeah, so they've been playing well uh, when they come to uh, play with us, uh, been doing very well, so hopefully they can keep it up. There's some big names in the later stages of the Europa League. You look at the likes of Ajax, Inter Milan, Rangers possibly. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's good, good teams are coming now and uh, we have to see now uh, who we take next. But uh, we'll be prepared and, and, and prepare everything to take them out. It's been some week for Manchester United, hasn't it? He's been nice, I don't know how many days, eight, ten days. Uh, another big important game for us on, on Sunday. Everton is doing good with the new manager, so let's try to keep it going. Well done, gents. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, I don't think many people saw that coming. Uh, what did you say at half time to get them going? Nah, it's the be more us, uh, be more, more Man United. Uh, I know it's difficult for uh, for players when you put put a team that hasn't really played together. Uh, so second half, we just found uh, the rhythm and more passes forward, runs forward, decisive, more pressing, and um, we got some um, great goals out of it. Mason Greenwood will get a lot of the headlines. Yeah. He's some finisher, particularly. Yeah, different class as a finisher. I have to say, he's, uh, when he's in and around the box, you, you expect him to uh, get a shot off and on target, because he's, he's so precise in his finishing, he's uh, good on his, the way he creates space for himself, either right foot, left foot, doesn't matter. So, very pleased with his uh, performance. Did you start to think back uh, quite a few years to when another 18-year-old scored a hat-trick on a big European night, Wayne Rooney? No, <laughs> no, no, no. He's a different type of player, Mason, than Waza. So, uh, but um, he must have, must have enjoyed tonight. And But the thing with Mason is he's just going to look forward to Sunday now. He's, he's not going to rest on his laurels or think about this. It's just natural for him to score goals, doesn't matter which level you're at. How important to be through as a seeded team? It was vital for us. Uh, you can have the second game at home. You might you, you play uh, a par or uh, a team that's lower seeded. But uh, it, the most important thing was that we got game minutes from from many players, some youngsters. Great experience for some of these. You know, getting through the first half, just keeping a clean sheet, and then doing as well as we did. Second half is the bigger thing than winning the group because I think some of these boys will remember how different it is to them little 5% extra that you give in the challenges, for example, or more precise in the passes, uh, work as a team, so everything's uh, worked out. They say a week's a long time in politics, fitting on election night, it's a long time in football. It's very long, of course, and uh, a lot of things can change in a week, but uh, for, for us we just want games coming and uh, the boys are in good shape, it's a good group. Today we had made, made nine changes, so of course we could have made a couple more, but then um, I'm looking forward to, uh, to seeing uh, how this December goes, because um, they're growing into a good group. Thanks a lot.